Dear students, welcome to the lecture series of Materials in Focus. In this lecture series, we will discuss about the atomic models. We will discuss that how the atomic structure is developed over the periods of time. The history of Adam begins about 25 years ago by the Greek philosopher known as the Democritus. He gave the philosophy about the smallest particle of matter. His philosophy or his theory is known as the theory of atomism. So the Democritus is a founder of the theory of atomism. According to the Democritus, the world is made of matter. If we cut the matter into very small pieces, there will be a point where the matter will be undivisible or uncatable. That point is known as the atomus. So, the world is made up of matter consists of tiny, uncuttable or undivisible objects known as atoms or uncuttables. According to Democritus, there is infinite number of atoms and all these atoms are same and made up of same stuff. The only difference in atoms is a difference in shape and size. So according to Democritus, atoms are made up of same materials, but they have different shapes and size. Some atoms have hooks and some have holes. So atoms with hooks and holes attach to each other and they form the different object which we see at the macroscopic scales. So according to the Democritus, the object we see with the naked eyes are basically hooked and holes of the atoms which are arranged in a different ways. So now question here is that how the world came into being. Democritus presented his own idea of the emergence of world. According to Democritus, the world emerged from the vortex of atoms. So when the bunch of atoms combines, they form a great vortex. The atoms combines as a hooks and holes. So the hooks and holes are basically entangled due to pushing and bouncing and sticking of the atoms. So the more closer are the the atoms the more denser will be the world so the heavier atom according to democritus congregated at the center whereas the lighter atoms are at the parameters so in this way they give birth to the matter earth So now, according to the Democritus, the movement and the attachment of atoms with each other is different, which will form different and big vortices. And this will lead to another, perhaps, the countless different types of the words. So what does this mean, dear students? This means that the attachment and movements of atoms in a different way will cause the different worlds. This idea is known as the multiverse theory. 
which straightforwardly depends on the attachment of atoms and which can cause countless different words. So in next lecture, we will discuss about the Aristotle idea of matter. Though the idea of Democritus was quite right, but the Aristotle was very famous in his times, so people were more focused, were more attached to the idea of Aristotle. In next lecture, we will discuss about the Aristotle idea of matter. Thank you for watching this video. For viewing more informative videos, watch and subscribe our channel Materials in Focus.